Well, I'm an idiot. Why? Because I recorded a Wi-Fi battle. I made it so the program only recorded the top screen, and then when I went back to uh, record more of this LP, because you know I was in the recording mood, I didn't turn the bottom screen back on again. So for the next three, four episodes ish, uh, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do for that bottom screen. But for right now, I'm lazy. So I'm just I'm gonna just leave that in there. So. Yeah, fail. Anyway. Hey everybody, it's Eastlick here, and welcome back to Let's Play Kirby Squeak Squad. Alright, let's do this. Uh, let's do uh, level 2 4. So, this is a level ought to be sure. It's only got uh, one treasure box to get for, and I think I remember this level. I know exactly what this level is. Wow, that model they survived the freaking rock. Oh well. Uh, let's see. Ooh, sword. Bam! The uh, treasure box for this area, you're gonna have to get to it before the rock, this rock right here does, and I believe it shouldn't be too hard if you just jump. Yeah, right here. Boom. Yeah, just get to it before the rock does, or else, yeah, you won't be able to get in here. And that's the end of the first level, so that was pretty quick. And something I should mention is that I finally got my uh, 3.5 millimeter audio splitter, so now I got audio, so I'm not deaf to this DS anymore. And why am I getting the firepower up? I should be using it. Alright. Didn't mean to do that. I mean to do this. Yeah, the fire up, the firepower up is really freaking broken, like I said before. And what is this? Ooh, the ice. Uh, can you? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and equip ice just to see if I can turn this this fire stuff off. And yeah, you can. Let's see. Freeze this guy. And I believe there should be a treasure box in here. Yep, I'm right. Uh, you can also use the uh wheel to uh, ride over lava. I'm pretty sure you can do that. I don't feel like testing it because I don't feel like letting go of my ice power, but you know what? I'll do it. Yeah, let's do this. Yep, you turn into yeah, you turn into a flaming wheel, and that's something that I really like about this game. And the way that you can mix up power-ups. Uh, you can mix the sword with like the three elements, uh, that being uh, fire, ice, and ouch, and thunder. And you can also miss wheel with, I, I think if you like go over grass, you turn really greenish, but I don't know, I'm not sure about that one. I do know if you uh, go over ice and then over water, the wheelie turns into like, the wheelie turns into a uh, ice wheel and you can like freeze the water you're going on, but wait, is that even necessary? The wheelie just can just like ride over the water, I mean, uh, Ow, okay, I think I know how to beat this boss. I could probably beat it a lot easier if I would just drop the wheel and start shooting him through rocks. Yeah, he's gonna walk at us pretty slow and... Yeah, this is gonna take a while. I think I might, I think I might just speed this up. Okay, so it's definitely a lot quicker if you just shoot the rock back at him. I don't know why they didn't just do that from the beginning, but you're gonna want to take the uh, get the metal power up because you have a uh, treasure box right here. Yep, you do. <laughs> Ooh, right here we have a uh, fighting ability. Yep, it's fighter. This lets you do uppercuts and down arrow kicks, something I don't know. See, I believe the ne last treasure should be in this room, if I remember correctly. No, it's not. It should be in the next room. Then. Yep, it's right here. And damn it, the fox has an advantage. All right, here, get some. Oh wow. Uh, let's see. Hit this. Open the door, and then hit this guy for having my treasure chest. Okay, so 
that was uh, level two of this. Let's see here. Yep, five minutes. So I think I could do two more levels. Now, if I get another paint color right here, I think I'm gonna switch. And no, I did not get a paint color, but you know what? I think I'm gonna switch anyway. Let's see here. What do I have? I have green, and that's it. Wow. Uh, let's go ahead and do the secret leg level. I, hopefully, I remember how to get all the tree. Uh, whoa, there! No, you don't. Uh, hopefully, I remember how to get all the three, three treasure boxes in here. Yeah, this level's looking really familiar. So. Yep, I know exactly where all three treasure boxes are. Now watch, I'm gonna end up missing one. Uh, free this guy. Kill this guy. And right here we have boss with the hammer. Oh, crap. Wow, that went a lot quicker than the metal guy, so... Take his hammer and use it to knock this thing in the digger down. Right here we should have the first treasure box. Yep, we do. Uh, can I mix two cherries together? Because I want to save some inventory. Yep, I got a potion. Free one up over here. Take that. Now, these enemies are really annoying. If you try to suck them up, I believe they get uh, attached to your face. And damn it, they yeah, blah, 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 I have a fork in the road. What do I do? I don't remember where to go, and I really don't want to have to do this level again. So I'm gonna have to put my money on the top one. Now, did I pick the right one? Oh, I hope I did. Damn it. This guy, this guy. Take the firepower up. And yep, I think I did pick the right one. I think I just missed it, did I? Yep, I'm pretty sure I just missed it. Yep, I missed it. Dang it. No, you don't! Alright. Looks like I'm gonna have to go back on that level. Do, 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 do. Come on, see if I can get another pink color for Kirby. Nope, I don't. Instead, I'm get another piece of heart, and that completes the first extra unit of heart we get. Alright, let's see here. I'll meet you guys up at that fork in the road I was uh, at. Alright. So the route you're gonna wanna take is the bottom one. And the treasure box should be not right there, but in the store. Oh, whoa, you're gonna wanna hit the switch before the golden water D walks off with it. Just kill him, and he'll drop the treasure box. So, meet you guys at the end. Alright, so... Alright, let's see what was in this treasure box. I got a secret map. Part of, part of a map to a secret place. Alright, I'm gonna help go ahead and end off this episode with the boss, and we got fire, we got random, we got ice, I don't wanna have to rely on my random, or try to get my, see what my random is during the boss, I'm gonna try to do it right now, and I kinda wish I had tornado because it will make my life easier right now. Oh wow, you can't eat that. Okay, so that's it. Star power. Wow, that was ridiculously easy. Yeah, these uh, Kirby bosses really ain't, 
really aren't that hard at well, like at least in this game because uh, I know in other Kirby games they are pretty challenging but in this game they're just a breeze so anyway with that we have completed world 2 next episode I'll be uh, starting off world 3 th uh, three, and maybe doing some more mini games so uh, thanks for watching and I'll